Let's all go for walkies. Let's all go for walkies. On a Monday, Monday night. Let's go for a walkies, guys. Abby's like, oh, Cousin Scooby came and he peed in all my pee spots. And now I have to go around and pee in every single spot all over again. Now, yep, yeah, that's the lamppost. I watched the vlog. That's the one, Dad. <laughs> Come on. Come on. Come on, before it gets dark. One last walk before it gets dark. Because walking in the dark is crap. But walking in the light. Is it starting to get light more now? I hope so. I don't think so, though. I think it's my imagination. Another question, you guys. When do you guys take down your Christmas tree? Because some people, like my brother, he just said to me he took his down on like the 26th or 27th. And some people keep it up. We're keeping up present until like the 8th or the 10th. So when do you guys uh, take your Christmas tree down? Ooh, look, a tree came down. Isn't it slightly spooky, but kind of nice? And it's kind of dusky. You know, it's like, look how light and bright it is. And as I move over here, it's like... It's twilight. Isn't this twilight? Twilight? Isn't that I thought what that twilight was like is? a book or something. About a vampire. Yeah, but isn't twilight... And a guy who takes his top off. Isn't twilight, <laughs> like, dust? Yeah, I think so. Something like that, isn't it? You guys know. You guys know everything. Someone's going to leave me a comment and let me know. It's like, they should set up like a Wikipedia or something. I don't know, but like... You guys are awesome. If I was in school and I had an exam, I would just ask you guys the question. I'd come back tomorrow and someone would answer it. Hey, we should we should do that. We should try and find... Although someone said that to me, they're like, can you do like a Jofus fact of the day or something every day? But I probably wouldn't remember every day to do it. But let's see if I can think of a question. A question that I can come up with that you guys would find difficult to answer. Of course somebody's got to answer it. Let me, let me ponder on that one. The tide is in. Oh God, look at that. It's so nice with the light reflecting off the water and it's like twilighty. It looks so cool. Isn't it, Albie? It's so nice. This is part of my lose weight in 2008. <laughs> what? <laughs> we never actually ever acknowledged New Year's Eve or New Year's or anything. Did you guys make any uh, resolutions or anything? I didn't really like we uh, Anna did do a mood board. She's going to try a mood board. An unfinished mood board. But she's going to try this whole mood board thing this year. I don't think you call it a mood board though. What do you call it? A wish board? A dream board? A resolution board? A resolution board? <laughs> resolution proclamation 605. <laughs> yeah, but something like that. But yeah, and I was thinking like, what do I want apart from a billion subscribers? I don't know. I don't know, guys. Because I want like 100,000 subscribers. 100,000 by this time next year. Yeah. Ooh. But you remember I was saying like, oh, if I can only get seven, and I got to seven. Do you remember ages ago we did the Circle of Commitment video? You guys should go back to the Circle of Commitment video and look if any of you guys left comments and see did you actually do what you said you were going to do? Because if not, you are a loser. Call yourself a loser right now. Leave me a comment and tell me if you're a loser. Hold on, let me just write a comment. I'm a loser because I did not achieve what I said I was going to achieve. But, you know, I did manage to make day vlogs every single day for 207 days. So, what does Jofus want to do this year? Well, apart from like, obviously, there's a lot of things that I'd want to do this year. One of the things that I was thinking, which is a realistic challenge that can be developed over the course of the day vlog, is that... Yeah, <laughs> let's get married. <laughs> we're over the bikes now. Oh. Get a Come on. Oh, runners and bikes. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> so I was thinking that, I'm probably like, a I don't say like I'm not over dramatically overweight, but I have developed little tum tums, and it all happened at my last year in college because I pretty much lived on Iceland, which if any of you guys in the UK know what that is, it's not good, but it's so cheap, and it's so tasty, but it's so bad, you know? So I developed little tum tums, and you know what? I've kind of like touched myself, oh, I should live my little tum tums, but you know, and then you forget, and then you know, here, it keeps reminding me on a daily basis that I'm a fat, a fat I pig. I never say that. <laughs> She does not say that, she does not say that, I'm making it up. But yeah, and I was thinking, you know what? I used to be really physique and feel of physics, so maybe uh, maybe that's what I'll do. You know, over the course of the next little while, you guys can uh, you guys can come along and maybe if you guys want to lose weight or something like that, hey, let's do it together, yeah! Look at all the, you can see all the Christmas trees in people's houses. That one in the corner is quite cool. <laughs> They've just got like lights everywhere. You can hear a dog barking. A little bit back there, so we're gonna go and investigate because he appears to be like in this sort of construction -y area place, which I don't think a dog like would be there, and he hasn't moved, so he obviously hasn't been walked. But hope he's okay. Might have to go rescue the little fella. We'll go and investigate. Jofus investigates. Okay, so 
I had a picture of the fence where I think the doggy is, which is over here. So we're gonna head over I'll this be. way and see if we can see the dog. I think I saw his little tail. Come on. Yeah, yeah. He's right up here. I don't want you going in the mist neither. He's behind this big fence wall thing here. Come on, Abby. Let's go see if we can find the doggy. Oh, goodness. No, 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 you go back in. Oh, I've seen them, Anna. That's the dogs. I see them all the time. Hello. 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 Can he not get through or something? The dog being like he's No, I see these dogs all the time. These are the two I saw on the motorway. Hello. Hey, but they're friendly. Maybe he's stuck in here. They're never in here. Oh, you picked up a rock. Did you pick up a rock? Look, they're like best friends. I see these two all the time, roaming around together. Oh, but like this little that. guy. Like, I don't really like flowers that much, but white roses are my favorite. Oh. Fancy roses. They're nice, aren't they? Do you know what roses stand for, guys? A white roses stand for, actually. When I was younger, I was such a little sap as a boy, right? So I had this girlfriend, and I used to like want to like be all like romantic and stuff. So I found out what each rose meant, and then each day I would give her a different rose leading up to. It was like blue was like a sorry rose, a yellow rose was a friendship rose, a red rose was a love rose, romantic rose, and a white rose was an eternity rose. So then I'd start off during the week and then I gave her a white rose at the end of the month. But uh, there's a white rose now. Whoa! I can give these to so many different girls. There's so much to choose from. <laughs> That's what my bouquet is going to be. A white rose? Yeah, just white roses. Well, there you go. Let's just get married now. I know. Do you? I do. Do you? I do. Well, there we go. Do you witness henceforth? <laughs> I now pronounce thee, Jophus and Nina. I was disturbed earlier on as we were discussing about our plans for New Year's resolutions. Leave me your New Year's resolution. Leave me your New Year's resolution below. All the live long day. All the live long day. <laughs> Why I like <laughs> <laughs> Oh, the Hong Johnson. <laughs> Name the video that that's from. What is the name it's of it? Oh, snap fooey guys! Gotta name the it name of that video. Olan John. Olan Johnson. Odon Piano. <laughs> Why? Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 <laughs> um, all the live long day. There's two versions of it. Yeah. There's a the second yeah. version which the day someone um made what he meant, there was a conspiracy about it. It's a cat. Hey, you're ruining well, it! Well, like, it's not gonna be that easy. Although, if you type it into Google, I think somebody made up, like, an actual that's, song. Yeah, yeah, that's the conspiracy thing about yeah, what each of the men and true history, how the cat's been everywhere. It's like a religion. Yeah, yeah, that's what it was. <laughs> Crazy. It's Crazy. Really funny. Crazy, yo. Welcome to Jovis. Welcome to Jovis. Fanfic of the day. Hi, I'm Joe Fest and welcome to my Fanfic of the day. Hi! Maybe that's a new thing I should put on the Joe Fest channel. Fun fact of the day. So, earlier on, I was trying to think of a fun fact or a fun questionable fact thing that I could tell you guys or a question of the day that you had to try and answer for me. Here, just popped in my head. Alright, guys. Just in case there's any smart asses there, they're gonna pause the video, okay? This is what, whoa, oh, okay. Could you actually tell from pausing the video? Do you know what I should do? I should run across it, okay. Question of the day, how many items, because there's cards and pictures and all sorts of things, on the subscriber wall currently? Okay, that's the question for today. You can roam around and look at all the other videos and try and figure it out or you can watch it from the start and count as I put them on but if you win you will win nothing but my respect and obviously I will name and name and shame I'll, I'll sh give you a shout out if you want one but that's what I will do that's what you have to do you have to answer me how many objects are on the subscribe wall now I have absolutely no idea
how many objects are on the subscriber wall because I can't guess. But I'm not going to like it. it I'm not including the chipboard thing. Okay, that's not it. Not including the tub tacks or anything that's used to uh, uh, stick the thingies up there. But cards and drawings and photographs and all that kind of stuff. Tell me. Leave me a comment. Let me know how many items are on the subscriber wall. And it'll be totally amazing if you get it right. So Mama Stalda had said to us about two days ago or something that a friend of hers had found a little Westie, two-year-old Westie, West Highland puppy, little white dogs. And they brought him to the vet, you know, and they scanned him and there was no chip on him, but he was neutered. So, you know, thought maybe he was lost or something. So a few days have passed and there's no sign of anyone picking him up, Renton. Oh, I don't know what I'm going to do. She asked around and no one was going to be able to take him, you know. So she said it to us and we were like, well, look, come on, we'll see what happens, you know. And, you know, I was talking to her yesterday and no one has taken him. So we're thinking, you know, we're going to go down there and we're just saying, uh, Mama Starlight's getting a number for me now. And we're going to bring Albie down and we're going to see, you know, did the two of them get along well? Because, you know, you saw yesterday with um, Scooby, my brother's dog, that he gets on so well together, you know, and I was thinking, you know, maybe, plus I'd... Make a lot of things easier, like when we want to go away. Yeah. Even just to the shop, you know. I'll be having Because like, we don't really do that much, and that's because we feel bad. Like, yeah. I'm, I feel really bad when we don't do things with Alby. But if he had a brother or a sister... This would be an older brother. Oh, she was a sister. But anyways, if he had a brother or a sister, um... Then he could stay here by himself. I mean, he wouldn't be by himself because he would have a friend. So. And I've got two controllers for the PlayStation, you know, so the two of them can like play together. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. It's a West Highland. I've had a West Highland before, and they are so well behaved and they're so quiet and very calm dogs. And Albie can sometimes be the complete opposite of that. Yeah. <laughs> so maybe you know the two of them might cancel each other out, or they maybe might quiet Albie down, or maybe Albie will teach the other dog how to be extremely noisy and spoiled rotten. Either way guys, the last thing I want to happen is this dog to get put down. And I know from making that pause video that if they bring him to the RSPCA uh, within five days, CSPCA, within five days they will put down a dog. And that is horrible. And to think that you know, we can afford to have another dog in our lives, and I think there's two of us, and two dogs, I think we can handle two dogs. Three dogs, it means that the dogs are outnumbering the humans, and that could probably end badly. But I think having, you know, two dogs, two humans, it might work out. So, I think we're going to go down there, we're going to see how, see how real, it really is. If we go there, and Albin and him start fighting, well, then clearly... That's also, you should explain, because people are asking why we didn't adopt one from Paws. Yeah, like the only reason we didn't take a dog from Paws is because uh, Paws have this uh, rules and regulations of adopting a dog. First step, they're all very big dogs, because the small dogs get shipped out and they go very quickly. You guys see where we live. We don't have a big garden, we don't have a big house. We have a house which is suitable for a small dog. Albie can run to his heart content around and around this house and it's big enough for him and our small balcony with our big garden at the back, our garden, our big kind of forestry area behind us for him to run around in. And that's like totally cool, you know? So for little dogs, perfect haven. Big dogs, not so much. Just not enough room. They will go insane in here. Plus I don't think we're really equipped for uh, big doggy handling. So Nina has run off on me and left me to find to myself. Ah! Oh, you think you're so smart, huh? You think she's so smart. I can get a fright. Of course you can get a fright. Who would be afraid of you? Because you would be breathing. <laughs> I just... I had to run 10 steps. Look at you, loser. Come here, you fucking fecker. Run, run. <laughs> Last one to the car is a loser. <laughs> yeah. I no way. No way. I touched it.